Also tonight, a Mexican citizen with a visa to study at the University of Tulsa now faces a rape charge after an investigation that began eight months ago. Authorities arrested former TU student Luis Molina on Saturday in San Antonio, Texas. Our Brian Miller is live near TU with more on this investigation. Brian. Yeah, Karen Molina still has not been charged with other crimes that could be related to this rape charge he is now facing once he gets back from Texas to face this. But the He's being charged so far with a rape that was recorded on his cell phone. That cell phone was recovered when police executed a search warrant on his campus apartment on Friday. That's when the university kicked him out of the apartment and removed him as a student. Now, this is an ongoing investigation. More charges could be coming. It's the investigation's been going on since February. That's when campus police first were alerted and began investigating a series of burglaries where female undergarments were being stolen. Two of those cases, a female victim said she was sexually assaulted, but it happened at night between the hours of 2.30 and 5.30 a.m., so they couldn't get a good description of the alleged rapist until fairly recently. Fast forward to October when we got our most recent burglary from the University of Tulsa. The victim actually was able to see a good description of the suspect. And through that investigation and, and that victim being able to describe him, we were able to develop the suspect, which was Luis Molina. And for tonight at 10, I'm working on getting reaction from the TU community about what they think about this rape suspect now of the former TU student. Reporting live from TU's campus, Brian Miller, Two Works For You.